Are you eating enough protein? Protein is essential, not just for muscular development, but also other cellular development, production of antibodies and hormone balance. So it's really important for performance, for your body to repair, to be resilient to illness, and just for you generally to feel more energized and for your recovery from workouts to be better. It's a really essential macronutrient. In addition, if you're looking to lose fat from your body, then protein will produce in your body glucagon, and glucagon is really important for moving fat from your body. And if you combine that protein intake with the reduction in your sugars and starches, it's gonna maintain a better blood sugar level for you. You're gonna find that it's much easier for you to lose fat from your body if your calorie, um, if you've got a calorie deficit in your daily diet. But how much protein do we need? Well, just for the general population that aren't training, you need one gram per kilo of body weight. So if you weigh 65 kilos, you need 65 grams of protein. But if you're training, if you're training hard and you're trying to build and tone muscle, then we're gonna look at between 1.5 and two grams of protein per kilo. So for myself, I generally look to have between 180 and 190 grams of protein per day. Protein sources being meat and fish and eggs and dairy. And then vegan sources would be stuff such as nuts and seeds, beans and pulses, soya, if you're a fan, I'm not a big fan of people having soya, there's some really good quality meat substitutes out there as well. And then we've got supplementation in there. How do we know if we need to take protein supplementation? So protein shakes, protein bars. The only way to know is to track, as I've recommended before, I always use my fitness pal, take a food diary, have a look at what your macros are. If you're meeting the macros from natural foods, that's amazing, that's great, and that's what we look for as an ideal, because Supplement should always be that, supplementing your diet, not part of your essential diet. But for those of you that are maybe on reduced calories or just haven't got the time to, to eat that much protein in a day, uh, protein shakes, protein bars are a good substitute. Just make sure that you're only taking them as a way of supplementing and not relying on those solely for your daily nutrition. Another tip on protein as well is to make sure you've got high quality ones. The cheaper the protein generally as a rule, the lesser quality it is and the more of an effect it's gonna have on your gut health and how it's gonna make you feel so you might not react too well to it and you don't really know uh, what's in it. So make sure you, you check your reviews on your protein and get some good quality sources of protein if you are supplementing. I think protein supplementation for vegans and vegetarians, especially vegans, because vegetarians may be having some dairy and some eggs so they can get their protein from those sources. But if you're not having those sources, then supplementation is pretty important unless you are using a really good meat substitute, which has all the essential amino acids you need, especially leucine, which is harder for a, a vegan to find in their, in their food sources. So I think really important to look into supplementation, especially if you're finding there's a, a plateau in your training, maybe something missing from your training or, or you're struggling to, to lose weight, then looking at your levels of protein you're having, looking at um, all of the amino acids you're having as well, making sure that you're getting enough protein in your diet is really, really important. So your first step is always to track, see how much protein you're having in your regular diet. And if you need to top it up, try and do that from natural food sources. First of all, if you need to supplement with protein shakes or some form of protein bar to get yourself up to those levels. Any questions guys, please put them in the comments below. I'll be happy to answer them. Thanks for watching.